check it out. Hopefully you can see this fireplace type thing. This thing with the star on it. As per usual, kind of shooting for the hip on this project. This is kind of like the last thing that needs to be done before the renovations are complete and we can move into this side of the house. So we're not in a huge hurry because our couch shows up in like, I want to say like three weeks or something. So it's not like we can really totally live over here in the meantime anyway, but I was going to knock this out tonight. Just put a mantle piece on here or a mantle. Mantle or mantle piece. I think mantle pieces are what you put on mantles. Anyway, it's that wooden piece that goes on top of a fireplace. And per Ali's request, we're gonna use this leftover wood that we use for the beam. No planning really going into this. We're just gonna kind of measure and cut as we go. And we've got a little bit of this wood that we can screw around with. So see what it looks like when it turns out. seems too long to me, it's too far out. What I should do is cut this top piece, figure out how wide it is. If it's too wide, I'll rip it. That's a way better idea. I'm gonna measure this first. I've got a pretty sizable gap here. So I'm gonna do a little Redneck engineering to try to get that taken care of. I'm literally just gonna cut like a little half moon shape out of that and kind of hope for the best, I guess. I don't know. You can see it's not like so much cracking. It's not totally sitting against the wall like it should, but I think I can just kind of, you know what I might do is just take a rip a piece of that trim that we put in the bedroom and just put it right on the top here. So nail that to the wall and nail the wall to this. It's gotta be a solution here somewhere. I just ripped this little piece. I think it's about a half inch. I'm just gonna set that in there. The mantle doesn't quite come up against that fireplace. So this is gonna help take up that space. And with any luck, it'll keep it a little more level. And then I might just nail it right into the wall. I think with this little spacer, it should be strong enough. <laughs> Basically it. One mantle down. I think it looks good. Throw some spar urethane on it like I did with the beam. I think it fits in pretty nice. It's actually pretty sturdy, sturdier than I thought. That spacer underneath really helped. With any luck, it'll add a nice little country feel to the place to go along with the beam and the bar top. And that's pretty much it for this one. Hope you liked it. Get out there and try this for yourself. Like this video if you like it. If you loved it, share it. Subscribe if you're not subscribed. Always remember, trust your guide. Thank <laughs> you.